Sarasota could be jumping on the plastic straw ban bandwagon. The city is looking into ditching plastic straws on city owned property and during city events. 10 News reporter Madison Allworth is in Sarasota and Madison, when will the city be making a decision about the fate of plastic straws? The city of Sarasota is voting on a plastic straw ban today. If the ordinance passes, it'll ban these straws from being used on city property and during city sponsored events. The problem, these pesky pieces of plastic can end up in our ocean, adding to the pollution problem. There are a number of cities and towns that have already banned plastic straws, including St. Pete, Fort Myers, Sanibel, Miami Beach and Fort Lauderdale, just to name a few. This past legislative session, the House and Senate both passed bills that would have blocked cities and municipalities from adopting their own straw and plastic bans. But those bills were vetoed by Governor DeSantis. It's estimated that about 8 million tons of plastic flows into the ocean every year. And straws, well, they make up just 0.025% of that. So why have they been the focus of environmental protection? Well, for one, that percentage still equals a lot of straws. It's estimated that about 8.3 billion plastic straws lie on our beaches around the world. The second part, it's an easy target. For able-bodied drinkers, we can do without the straw. With Sarasota's close connection to the beaches, the city is looking to protect marine life and our oceans. People opposed to these bans point to it limiting private business control and the burden it could put on handicapped individuals.